Was there anything that you learned from your time in venture that you took and implemented as your time as an operator? Yeah, I mean, there's there's a lot that you can know in terms of like bringing that experience of, I think the, the understanding of how fast and how hard you have to push the just <laughs> metrics of not running out of money because there was too many stories, you know, of success, trying to implement some of the successes and making sure you stay away from the failures and really making sure, you know, burn's really important early on. The easiest way and the fastest way to kill a business right is run out of money. And that's oftentimes the case, unfortunately. And so being really mindful around what you have to do to get to the next level has been really helpful here in terms of our ability to build the business in the right way and the way we want to build it. Your seed, you were able to get it. Was your A any easier? Well, yeah. So we actually ended up with, you know, that $2 million initial push and then knowing it always takes a little bit longer to build something. And so Crosslink Capital came and David Silverman sits on our board, came out a few months later uh, in later 2018 and also led it kind of a seed extension. So put a few more million dollars into the business that mm. really gave us that needed liftoff for a Series A. 